What's up, you guys? Eddie Fliptronic. So, um, you know, I'm going to put uh, an answer to rest here about if it's um, a bad thing to charge your iPhone 6S or iPhone 6S Plus overnight, or really any iPhone for that matter. Um, you see, you guys, the thing is that uh, these iPhones use a lithium-ion battery, uh, which is pretty much the same thing as a laptop battery. So if you've ever noticed, uh, when whenever you plug in your iPhone, um, I'm sorry, your laptop, it tends to, uh, you know, get warm at the bottom uh, if it's plugged in for a long amount of time or if it's turned on for a long amount of time. The same really applies to your iPhone battery. So um, whenever you've got this thing plugged in, if it hits 100% and then you leave it plugged in past 100% for a set amount of hours, you'll notice that it feels hot on the back. This is because it's overheating because you've left it plugged in for too long. And it might not um, you know, do a lot of damage at first, but over time it will deplete the battery faster. So it's a good idea, you guys, to unplug your phone after it's hit 100%. You don't want to leave it plugged in for an additional like three to six hours since it's kind of pointless and it's just going to make your iPhone you know, get warm. So uh, the answer to the question here is, you guys, you don't want to leave it plugged in overnight. Um, you want to unplug it once it hits, hits 100% just so you don't do uh, damage to the battery. The other thing, guys, too, is it's not like you can remove these batteries anyways. You have to pretty much get a whole new iPhone these days, you know, and uh, Samsung's pretty much moved over to the same thing as well with not having any more removable backs. So, um Anyways, uh, that's the answer to that, guys. Definitely feel free to comment below. Stay tuned for more and be sure to subscribe to our channel.